Welcome back. I'm also back from a um, short break. Actually, yeah, from recording. I have been uh, grinding for uh, some personas off screen. And I think I have about, well, at least one persona, one new persona each for everyone in the party and yeah I learned some things on the way and yes to be honest I did read up a few things too as well uh, to uh, make it a little bit less time consuming there were some things with the game I I wasn't sure if I would do was doing things right and uh, in retrospect, I think I would have quite a bit of a problem still if I... Yeah, I would be in big trouble if I would keep playing as I've been doing. And I'm gonna see if I can... Uh, yeah, progressively gather personas while I progress through the story. Time will tell, but yeah. Now that I now that I know what I should do, you shouldn't. Yeah, you as a viewer should not probably notice anything at all. So hopefully I wouldn't won't need to do any off-screen grinding. To well, to a noticeable extent. Anyway, we are at the moment at Gold, which is some kind of sports club or yeah, fitness gym or whatever uh, in the Yumisaki district. I think it's Yumisaki. Anyway. Whoa! Yeah, and we're looking for detonation devices, and we <laughs> we just found one seems like uh, Maya's friend punched so hard the sandbag broke and yeah we found the detonation the detonation device inside it so we have to look through the whole building to find yet another transmitter and another part of the blessed oracle, I take it. What? Who? Uh, someone took all your money? Okay. Well, yeah, now we know for sure that this is the right place. I don't think there's any bombs in here, right? No well, transmitters are... Well, I can't see any bombs right here. Yes! Didn't you hear us? You were standing right there. Why would a club be safe from terrorism? No one's safe. Not with a maniac like that running around. Uh, it doesn't seem. Yeah, I can't click on anything here. Oh, there was some some guy here. You need to drop sixty pounds. Well, good luck, dude. But I think really think you should go. So, yeah, yeah, being alive is more important than losing a few pounds. If, well, what's it gonna be your life or losing some weight? Anyway, we are, uh, yeah, we're looking through this building right now. And it's quite huge. Oh. Oh. Wow. That, that was, that was dangerous. Hmm. 
no problem. <laughs> I'm surprised he actually managed to react and save her from that. Yeah, they seem, they seem to be everywhere, but I just can't click on anything to see them for myself. As in, yeah, as I could back in the music hall. But never mind, yeah, they're definitely here. The only thing I can do is to kill them. But I don't mind because. Yeah, I did equip. Oh, well, I did swap uh, in the new personas I summoned, so. This is good. This is a good opportunity to rank. Yeah, to rank them up. I do notice that the higher the. The higher the personas are, the more SP they use up all the time. Oh, and I found this fusion spell by chance when I was grinding personas. I wish I could find some more though. The more the merrier, as they say. Yeah! Let's go all out. <laughs> and yeah, naturally, uh, as I was uh, grinding for personas, there wasn't really much chance to gain any levels. So at most, I only gained one level maybe for a few of them. Uh, yeah. And uh, I'd say that everyone le everyone's levels are a little bit spread out because, well, at least one person have died. Well, some of them have died during boss fights and such, which really makes them lag behind a bit because bosses really do give a lot of XP. Oh, and one thing I did learn was that um, when it, yeah. When you choose the contact option in the menu, and then when you select a demon, you see uh, there's a oh, there's a window to, down to the bottom right, saying maybe like oh, so uh, a quantity and a card. So, at for for example, if they say zero. You don't have any cards of that uh, Arcana type. So as you can see back there with the Kraken, which is um, aligned to the world Arcana. Yeah, I apparently have 250 world cards. And yeah, I used to think that... And before... yeah. Before I thought it was uh, basically, oh, so this is how many cards he has on him, which I can make him give me if I use the right conversation options. But apparently that was wrong. It's actually the amount of cards I have get, gathered of that type from that type of Arcana. And I use the term Arcana here, I don't know what it's actually called here, but yeah, I use the term Arcana since it's a ter the term I've seen in uh, at least Persona 3. <laughs> and sorry if I keep making references to the, to the other Persona games, it's just that it's one of my favorite, favorite games.
Well, actually, those two are two of my favorite games. Okay, I, I really doubt there's anything here. I can't even touch it. 